Hello YouTubers! <coughs> back again. Like I said, welcome back to Yorkshire 166. I'm Cole Mark, I'm your host, presenter, whatever. Um, I'm here for a review. I know it's a little bit late, but there you go. That's what you get for being lazy. Never mind. We, yeah, we all go to sleep late, late, late. Or up early this <laughs> Yeah, I woke up early this morning and it was freezing, I'll tell you. Yeah. So, I'm here to do a review. And I said I'd do a review on this. This is... Uh... Now, I will remove the sticker. Because somebody asked me to remove all these stickers. I, 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 <laughs> I, I'll remove this one because it ain't got the price. Yeah, so we, we are reviewing Sonic. You know, we are reviewing... This particular thing, Sonic, Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog, in it really. So that's what we we're, we're reviewing. Came out in ninety one. Um, on that, now I got this with my Mega Drive when I bought it. Um, when I first got a Mega Drive, back in the day, yeah, you know I mean. So it, you know. It's only a one play 16 bit game, but what I liked about it at the time, it, I mean, it's Sonic the Hedgehog, it's Mega Drive. I didn't know what to expect. I knew it was a platform game, so I played it. I could never get off the first zone, though. You know, you know I, could, I could get to end it, Green Zone, but I could never get any further than that. I could never defeat Robotnik at all, Do Oops, Dr. Robotnik. But I have played it. And I played it this week, and I've been playing it for seven days, and I still can't get off of that off that particular level. Oops, because we've got hiccups. Particular level, but what I like about it is speed. Yeah, it's got the speed. It, it's it's got everything. I mean, you're collecting rings. I mean, the game is so simple, but it's so easy to lose as well. To lose that, you know, to lose all your rings, basically. But yeah, I like the hidden gems where you can get the speed boots to go around and things like that. You know, you get all the speed ups and things like that. Um, yeah, you, you jump on certain things, it gives you shoes or, or, or is it force field or whatever. And that. But yeah, it's a, it's a good game. It really is. <coughs> a lot of people say it's a bit bland on colours. Well, on TV I've got, I mean, I've got a modern TV. But wait, tell you what I had at the time. I had a Sony Trinitron at the time when I when I had my my original Mega Drive. I put it on that, and it was pretty clear. Now I put it on this. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes. It's a new telly. I've got an LED telly, and it's a lot more clearer. But this, yeah, you know, colours on it. They are okay for what they are. I mean, a lot of people say, "Oh, well, Sonic Two is better than that." I don't disagree. Sonic Two. That they took more time over it to make it better than this, but this is the first Sonic. I mean, this one started me off with the Mega Drive, and I I love Sonic the Hedgehog. I really do. I get what Sonic's all about. You know what I mean? I'm I'm not a Nin. How can I put it? I'm not a Nintendo thing, am I? I I'm not a Nintendo fanboy or like that. Yes, I like. I've got the GameCube. I've got the Nintendo, and I've got the Nintendo Wii. But I just don't get Mario. I just don't get it at all, but this I do get. Um, this I, I spent hours and hours and hours on this playing this this particular game, and I mean I, I mean I mean I spent a lot of time on it. Yeah, you know I mean when I can and things like that. Yeah, you know. I can go on this right now, I, I, and I could go on it. You know, I say oh I'll go on it for about an hour. It'll be like four or five hours later. It does take your time. It is addictive. It's a simple game to play, which it is. It's, there's nothing hard about it. But it shuts an addictive game because you always want to do better and better and better and better. And that's what this does. It, it really does. It, it really grabs you. Now, so this is the 2D version. This is the version where I remember playing in arcades and things like that. But, um, yeah. When Sonic went 3D with, with uh, Dreamcast. Now, I don't know if, if many people uh, agree with this, but Sonic Adventures came out and that was fantastic. But I think Sonic Adventures 2, I think that's the better one. 
and, that, and now there'll be a lot of people that hate it being comments will <laughs> but I think I'm right on that um, but yeah I do love Sonic uh, I really do um, this particular game yeah it's complete it is complete guys it, it, it's yeah it's a bit doggy you know manuals a bit tattered but what do you expect yeah, it came out in 91 what do you expect it, it's been played and played and played but it's good isn't it it's complete I'm happy with it um, I'm happy with everything with what I've got for Mega Drive so far but I know people when I did that yeah, you know, my five favourite games at Mega Drive. Of course, oh, well, Terminators for me. Well, them five games are the, uh, you know, what I showed you. I've got more than that. But them five games, what I showed you is, I'm picking what I want for this system. I, I, you know, I'm not intending to collect all of it. I'm intending to collect the games what I want to play. Uh, things like that, you know what I mean? So, so, you know, so Sonic the Hedgehog, I want Sonic 2, then I want... Sonic and Knuckles and Sonic pin, you know, Spinball and, and these will be the games what, what, what I would want for it and, and you know, go on from there and that's really it but as what do I give this? well I don't know it's not a sports title I mean I do rate this and I rate it highly so I give it a 9 a 9 out of 10 I give this a 9 out of 10 yeah I rate it above FIFA I really do even though it's an older game but I do rate it. I rate it really well. It's it's an arcade game. Yeah, it's what you used to play on arcade machines and that. And it's fun. It puts a smile on your face. Well, it does with me. <laughs> As you can tell. It does with me. Yeah, I mean, it, it does put a smile. A lot of people don't like this particular game, but I do. And it's the game what I've been playing. And, and things like that. And I do like it. I like the way the game starts. Yeah, you start from Green Zone 1. And you run through, collect all the things, and then you go from there, and then you go through zone two and things like that. I've got right up to where I can get Robotnik, but I never beat him, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I'm a bit too slow for that. But I do like playing it, and I play it over and over again. I've never completed the bloody thing, but well, one day I might. One day I might just complete it, but it's a good it's a good platform game I, I really do rate it and I rate it highly um, yeah. I mean it's all very well as well so yeah it is a mega drive and it is really a fantastic game I mean they had it on Master System as well as far as I know they had, they had all Sonic's on Master System but I'm collecting for mega drive. it's a 16 bit machine Whereas the you know, is it the Master Systems an eight bit machine, so sixteen bit for me. And I'll, I'll be collecting as much as I can. If I can get all the Sonics for it, I'll be happy. And if I can get the games what I really want, and then I'll be happy again. But ah, yeah, I mean, there's not much more I can say about this game. All I can say is yes, you go around collecting things. You collect all the things. You you collect the speed shoes and you collect the force field and. And you can dig, you know, you can tunnel your way through and things like that. You know what I mean? There's hidden passengers. <laughs> There's hidden passages, or whatever. Passages, what you can find and, and go through. And things like that. You know what I mean? I spent hours on it. Hours and hours and hours. It's, <laughs> it's one game. What will stick with me forever, that. It really is. I love it to bits. So what else can I say? Well... Not more. There is a very, very good flavour. There's a very wide range on the Mega Drive. As far as I know, there's there's a, over a thousand games for this system. Um, but I won't be collecting nowhere near that. What I'll be doing, I'll be collecting the games what I remember when I had mine. And I've got some of them games already. And I'll get more. If I can get 20 or 30 games for it, I'll be happy. It'll keep me happy. And I get a secondary system, that'll be even, I'll, I'll be even chuffed in my, more chuffed to bits with that. Yeah, I do like it. It's a good game. It's not as complicated as, as, as what people say. It's not a complicated game. It's an easy game to play. It's addictive. i tell you that. It's very addictive. I mean, I went on this. I was only supposed to be on it for an hour. Two, three hours, at least. You know what I mean? I've even fallen asleep with this. 
you know, I've been playing it that much. I've, I've nodded off and I haven't realised and I've had control of me hand. <laughs> System on deck, you know what I mean? So there you go. Sonic the Hedgehog. Health warning. Very addictive game. And it is very addictive and I like it. I like this. Um, I do like all the other Sonics. I have played all the other Sonics. I played Sonic 2, which is... Yeah, when you look at Sonic 2 and look at this side by side, Sonic 2 pops because the colours are better. Um, I, I give it that. But I like the original. <laughs> I come back to this all the time. But yeah, Sonic 2 is pretty good. I've played all the Sonics, don't get me wrong. But but last week, I've been playing this. Now, it's very comfortable. Yeah, well, I do like the Sonic. I mean, keep Yeah, I do like it. I do love it. There's not much more I can say. And I'm not going to, you know, spin this video that long that I'm, you know, I start talking crap because I'm not going to talk crap. All I can do is, I recommend it. If you haven't got it for your Mega Drive, you should have it. It's cheap enough to get. It's common enough. Go get it. It's a good game. It, it really is. And I think most people have already got this uh, and things like that. So, yeah. It's what I remember. Yeah, you know, I mean, I, I come from Commodore 64 games. It, you know, my, you know, that that was my first gaming system. But after that, it went Mega Drive. And I liked it, and I really do. I really do like the Mega Drive. I like the Sonic, you know, I like all about the game. I like how, the, you know, a bit of storyline goes with it, and it's not really, but it is. You can tell, you know, to get to the end and to beat Robotnik. And that's what it's all about. And then you start on Zone 2, don't you? And go through that way. Well, I've never got off a zone one, so there you go. So that's my that's my play and review of the week. Um, I hope you like it. Um, I know I like like this and that. I love it to bits. Sonic the Edge from Sega. Yeah, I really do. It's one of my favourite games. And if people haven't got this, I don't understand why why you wouldn't have it, unless you don't like it. <laughs> you know what I mean? But if you haven't got it, you should get it. You know, Sonic the Hedgehog is it, it, fantastic. It, it really is. I love the, the Hedgehog character. I really do. And I even love it more when Tails comes into it. And then Knuckles. It, with other Sonic, you know what I mean? Sonic and Knuckles. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah, yeah. I do really like this. So there you go. So that's my play and review of Sonic the Hedgehog. I hope you like it. If you have by any chance like this video please give it a thumbs up please 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 subscribe and hit the notification bell and it all that will let you know when I'm putting up a video please consider to su consider subscribing for a bit more fun like this and please share the video to Facebook to Facebook Twitter and then and all your friends if you want the more you share it gets out there the better and the more people can watch it um, what else Alright, and please comment below. I do answer all my comments, I really do. Well, I try to, in any case. If I missed anybody out, I do apologise, but I do try to answer all the comments and that. And, yeah, and I just want to thank all my new subscribers. Now, if some of my new subscribers have come from Yorkshire Labs, I thank, him for, I thank Yorkshire Labs for giving me a shout out, and I thank you for coming over to me. I really do. I think Yorkshire Lad's got a great channel. He really does. He, he does his best. I know he hasn't been on for quite a few weeks, but he does his best. And it, it, it is what it is with Yorkshire Lad. I, I like his content. I really do. Um, and that, I'm hoping you like my content as well. But there you go. So there you go. So I'd like to thank all my subscribers. All the new subscribers. Well, you know, I'd like to thank you all for join us and hopefully having a bit of fun and i like to thank all the subscribers what well, i've been here for a while you know what it's all about let's hope it continues and i catch you on the next video so bye for now